Character spacing is nothing more than taking a bunch of characters like, let's say, or even just one, two characters and creating a spacing between them, a gap, without hitting the space bar so it's horizontal. Or you can do it vertical, like let's say you take this word, leading, and want to not make it superscript so it's like in math to the nth power where it's tiny and up above the rest of the text within the sentence, but just bumping it up more and keeping it within the same line, basically. So to get started, let's go ahead and do, stretch this out horizontally, the spacing here. Success that never changes the title, make it look like a fancier title, and then come up here on the Home tab in the Font group and click its expandable dialog box button, and there's the shortcut, Control D. And we'll click on the Character Spacing tab, and we'll say we want the spacing to be expanded. You can see down the preview when it automatically expands it by one point, but if we select that and type 2 over it and hit the Tab key, boy, that really gets expanded. Click OK. Not too bad. Okay. So we know how to stretch it out horizontally to get the spacing in between each character. What if we took like some text here leading and we did the same thing. We clicked on the font um, expandable dialog box button and we want to position that as raised. And we want to do it by three points. You can see the line comes across and it's being raised by three points. Maybe we could do it by just a little bit more and click OK. It's within the same line but it's raised within that line. Thanks for watching. Hey, as a quick reminder, if you like my video, please give it a thumbs up. You can also click on me and subscribe to my channel, get notified of the latest videos, and for only $2 a month, you can have access to all my Microsoft Office training videos.